Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Yeah, uh, doing this in my new makeshift office. Uh, I've uh, converted my bar here into a makeshift office to watch uh, the rugby and, and to work from here from now on. Uh, so yeah, just uh, this is not to do with the Rugby World Cup though. This video is about something that happened in a game this weekend uh, between Saldana and another club in the Boerland Rugby League, uh, which is quite interesting. Now, unfortunately, this isn't the first time these type of things have happened, uh, and we see it from in club rugby from time to time, but it's never nice to see. Um, but yeah, it was between Saldana and St. Helena. Apparently, the first round match between the two, St. Helena got a, a, a disciplinary action against them. And so what happened at some point in this game that th these two sides uh, decided they were ahead enough of each other, and two players started they have throwing punches. Uh, the ref had no option but to send both players off, but that didn't stop everything as it ended up to be quite a fracker. And um, yeah, it's not great to see. This is a video that was placed in the Berlin Club Rugby Group. This shows what happened. The one player was sent off and he was on his way off the field, and the other player followed him. And that's where these two started getting to action. Uh, the fist started flying, and it just became a free for all from there. There's some more video I'm going to show you now as well. Now this is another idea that we got the same incident. You can see the play people running in there and spectators coming in and then it just goes worse. And then a lot of players and people get involved and it becomes a free for all. Uh, I must admit these are the shocking scenes in rugby. It's not what we should be seeing in a club rugby game. Uh, especially because Soldana is the one team that's going to be in the Gold Cup uh, rugby. But this is really, it just gets out of hand here. You can just, yeah. What can you say? Danny Tim! Thank you for Danny! Now, apparently that wasn't all that happened. They, they didn't capture everything on that, but it became quite heavy. And and, and uh, there's a lot of calls for something to be done. Now, I see the Boerland has come out with a statement uh, saying violence is no place in sport. And I'm just going to read it to you as well now. The statement reads uh, that the Boerland Rugby Union is shocked and dismayed at the incidents of violence and thuggery that led to the abandonment of the match between Saldana and St. Helena by a rugby club. We have noted with grave concern the content of multiple videos and media reports relating to these incidents of violence. Uh, the BRU is gathering available information, is awaiting incident reports from both these clubs as re is required under the competition rules and regulations. Um, they will also regard any reports filed by the match officials. It's also been referred to the disciplinary committee. Uh, and uh, yeah, you can see it's, it's that this is not the type of behavior that you want to see on a rugby field. I think this part is quite, quite, uh, yeah, Boerland has over, over 200 clubs. But this point that they make here, rugby is not violence. Rugby is not throwing stones or bottles. Rugby is not punching and fighting. Rugby is not thuggery. And the BRU will not allow its grand challenge to be reduced to incidents of violence. All clubs, the executives, players and supporters must know that the BRU will act with absolute conviction to protect the game. Um, I agree, and I think there is a process that needs to be followed. Um, obviously, what's happened with, with Saldana being yeah, in the Gold Cup, they've had to make a decision and they're going to carry on. But yeah, this is not a great situation. It's not a great look for Boerland Rugby. And, you know, for a, a province that produces so many, so many top Springboks and so many top players, you know, this is really, the, the rugby thrives in the Boerland. It's got over 200 clubs. Um, you know, it's one of the most uh, rugby fertile parts of the country. But if this is the way it's going to be, and I know hopefully this is an isolated incident, and and, and uh, you know, the Boerland should act. And as they say, they're going to. So we'll watch this space. Saldana carry on, though. They go and play in the Gold Cup now. So I think everybody will be watching to see if this is an isolated incident or if there's other things involved. But I, but I think this is, you know, for a game that we all love and a game we respect, and I think this is not on. So, yeah, I think those should be afforded the, the chance to defend themselves. 
But yeah, I think I can see a hefty penalty coming to both clubs and to the players involved as well. This is really not a... But anyway, thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, please do to the channel. There's a lot more rugby content coming your way.